Many of the 90 million young people in Latin America and the Caribbean aspire to become star athletes. Innovative sports for development programs take advantage of youth's passion and dedication for sports to help them develop skills for life. In fact, sports are playing a key role in supporting programs in the areas of employment generation, violence prevention, and social inclusion. We think there's many other things that one can create uh, around soccer uh, and around fighting uh, problems of crime in many of our major cities around Latin America. Um, and it's also a way uh, to really bring a better tomorrow for many children uh, and to give them hope. For example, the project known as Aganar in Ecuador and Uruguay and Vencer in Brazil, meaning to win, seeks to improve employment opportunities for young people. By the end of 2008, this program expects to have more than 3,000 young people ready to score a goal in the labor market. I think this is a fantastic idea and program that, through sports, in this case soccer, can connect young people and try to place them and guide them in their future profession, not only in sports but in other activities. The Compañeras de las Americas organization, which is implementing the project, uses young people's passion for soccer to train them for other professions. The idea is to have young soccer players apply the skills learned on the field to the real world. I'm learning a lot of things. Some I already knew, but others are new, like respect, discipline, teamwork, self-improvement, and a results-oriented approach. Within the framework of the Football for Hope movement, organizations the likes of FIFA have established an alliance to turn sports into an engine for social development. The objective of the agreement is to launch projects in the region's countries that put a soccer ball at young people's feet. This initiative, which is partly funded by the government of Korea, is a regional initiative that will benefit all the countries of Latin America and the Caribbean. The main objective is poverty reduction and, of course, social inclusion. We want to make sure that all youth in the region, young girls, young boys, marginalized youth, will be able to receive the benefits of this type of program. Benefits that include nutrition, values, creating safe environments where young people can play and young people can learn. 60% of young people in Latin America and Caribbean countries live in poverty. Playing soccer, young people can achieve something more than trophies and medals. They can rise up as champions of their own lives and score goals for a bright future.